this is actually our 25th annual Duck Derby. Um, and we have not only, you know, the actual race that just occurred, but also it's a free day at the museum. It was fantastic. We had a great group of people come out today, and the fire department stayed and made sure that all the ducks came through. Um, and this year we had the new business sponsor race, so Blaine's Farm and Fleet won that this year. And we had some new activities, too, so it was just a great, great turnout for the 25th. We decided to just kind of vamp it up a little bit with, you know, more activities for the kids. So Next to Kiln is out here. Um, we had face painting. We have, as you can see behind me, um, several bounce houses. And then we have a physical duck race, so kids actually get to pick their own duck that they get to go home with, but they can race it on a track in the back of the museum. The race, I mean, just having all the ducks come through. This is my fourth duck derby, and I've always been the one helping catch, so it's so fun because you know they're all gonna start coming at you at once. The firefighters come, and they get the water going, and they power those ducks out of the grain bin through the track, and, um, you know, until we have a winner. There's different objects in the track that the du ducks dodge. Um, it happens very quickly. <laughs> it's the best and of course we're waiting down at the end anxiously for all of them to come down and it was it was a blast I think the kids really enjoyed it this year it's I think it's a, a great event obviously it's lasted I mean not many fundraisers you know can last 25 years I think even being part of a, a board it's hard to come up with different ideas for the community that um, you know continues to get interest and continues to get bigger year after year but um, it's been successful in doing that